dealing with P. Okay. Okay. This is how the deal went down. And I'll make it, it's kind of long, but I'll make it quick. Go ahead. Suge Knight, Snoop was out there being disrespectful. Wanted to go. Our, we had lost a million and a half dollars a month guaranteed to $300, $350,000 a month guarantee. It was getting cut. <laughs> people had a, people had to, was losing, wasn't getting what they were accustomed to getting. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, I, 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 I jumped all the way into it right now since you're saying that, because we just interviewed Anthony Boswell okay. from Master P, and we yeah. just did that. And um, Big, uh, yeah. he, he dope dude. Man, I enjoyed the conversation. They give a shout out to the Drug dealer. Neighborhood dope, man. I mean, real. But I talked to him about when he came and got Snoop, when he had to go in and vouch for Snoop, you know, to come, him and P now. So... There we go. When we see him, I'm like, damn, that's the dude. You know, my yeah. dude, what's up? You know, when I meet him, I'm like, dude, you know what I'm saying? Here, I took my chain off my neck, no limit, bam, put it on his. Wow. I never took my chain off my neck. Oh, yeah. And put on nobody, neck. You nobody Houston. like that but you. Uh, Houston, you I remember that? that like yesterday. I said, man, you with us. You but know what but wow. what did Suge say about this? And did y'all already work that out that he would be going with y'all? No, initially we just we, we saw him and we saw the situation he was. We just took charge of it. Did you ever have conversations with Sugar or any Yeah, P did. P did. P no did. Talk. I don't, you don't do no talking. No. <laughs> yeah. Said interview and I this is the real, y'all. I'm sitting right there. There ain't no what well, Reggie heard, Reggie know all that. So you were right there I was when right it happened. There so P. Anthony Boswell I, was there too? But Master P only talked to Reggie Wright and he knows that. So I don't even know so, who Anthony Boswell. So Boswell was. was not there. I don't even know who the hell he is. Really? Other than that, you two. Never met him. I'm sure he done saw me. Uh, I'm sure we done been in yeah, the, probably been the, the same, same room. Dealing with P. Okay. Okay. This is how the deal went down. And I'll make it, it's kind of long, but I'll make it quick. Go ahead. Suge Knight, Snoop was out there being disrespectful. Wanted to go. Our, we had lost a million and a half dollars a month guaranteed to $300, $350,000 a month guaranteed. Shit was getting cut. <laughs> People had a, people had to, was losing, wasn't getting what they were accustomed to getting. Yeah. She was registered in there now. All right, I got to make this budget work. Nigga, you got to turn that car in. You got to move out of that penthouse. This got to happen. This is what's happening. So, you know, we're cutting costs. Snoop out there now. He freeload. I mean, freelancing, not freeload. Yeah, freelance. Freelancing to other things and doing stuff and getting a little money. Did something with Master P and now on an album. They, he say Master P gave him thirty thousand dollars or something like that. Blessed him, you know, and all that. That's true. That's true. Master P looked out for him. He got on the song, but now me, Reggie Wright, on the business. Like, hey, sure. Oh yes. Matter of fact, send Brian Turner up here. Tell Brian to come up here. I don't deal with no Master P. Who put it out? Priority? Okay. Brian comes up to the prison. There was a deal being worked out for Snoop, and Brian was going to distribute it, and, and Snoop was going to be sold to, you know, straight to Interscope. At the last minute, because we all, you know, because the, the negotiation had just went down with Pac and all of that. With this state, Jimmy's like, you know what, Reggie? Tell Sugar I only want to be in the Tupac business with him now. I don't want to be, I don't want Snoop. Because they were about to do, pay seven or eight million dollars for, for Snoop at that time. Wow. But they were going to go in it together to buy Snoop rights. Seven, eight million dollars ain't nothing now for, uh, you know, Snoop that was an artist that was on his uh, caliber at the time. But Jimmy didn't need a headache no more. Now he's hitting home runs. Where, and now he's not just a private company. He's owned by Seagram, MCA, you know, or Edgar Brofman and them at the time. And so now he got board members and people to answer to. It wasn't just like him and Ted Fields cutting checks. And he was like, oh, so he blamed it on them, which I knew it was just him pretty much or Dre, because now he got over there trying with the firm. Eminem hadn't broke for Dre yet, but they trying. Dre's on recoup, $21 million. So, but he but he went in with the white groups, Beck and No Doubt and, and all of that. Uh, that was signed to Interscope at the time. 
So Jimmy did bail out. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.